Do you want more great content from me? Check out the description box down below. Hello Adam, good morning. Where are we going today? We are going to We will be proceeding in... down the transport mechanism towards the direction of Warrington. It's just so silly. Know, yeah, so every time he's on video. Obtuse. Every time he's on video. So, yeah, where we're actually going, we're not going to Warrington, are we? We're no, near no, Warrington. we're going to Stockton Heath. Yeah. To, um, to what? For what? For what? To the charity shop! And what for what else for you two? <laughs> to uh, the well, pub. No, I want for, to say loads. For what? Cafe. For what else? And and no and what else? Tuna to watch the rugby. No, you know your little M and S dining oh, for two yeah. things. Well, we'll see. I don't think there's dining for two on this week, but we'll have a look in M and S for some food. Right, okay. Right, let's get going, eh? Let's okay. Get going. Woohoo! I want get to going. just have a last sip in the cup of Got tea. Got some painting to do. Yeah, but let's get going. Yeah, you're hyped. But I need to paint. Are you pumped? Yeah, hyped. Come on, fist bump, fist bump. You're hyped. I need to paint. Woohoo! Right, great. Yeah, what time? Well, it'll have to be latest half twelve, won't it? If we've got the car at yeah. twenty past one. Well, shall we say twelve-ish? Yeah. Can, so, all right, all right, and then we can sort cause something else. There. Yeah, because. Okay. Um, have you got your little yeah, little? I've, got little... I've not. I've only got one. Out. 
Well, it's a lovely sunny day today. In fact, it's quite annoying because it's hard to get a good shot. But um, yeah, I'm going up to the, my local charity shop because I've really got like a non-existent haul to show you. So I'm going to do that and then uh, come back and hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll got a couple of other bits. So then it makes uh, the haul at the end of the video a little bit more worthy of showing you. So yeah, I'll see you in a minute. Well, guys, I think the charity shops are dead. I think that's it. There's no more reselling, no more reselling, we can't resell anymore, that's it, it's dead. Nah, I'm only joking, I got all this as well. Um, but yeah, basically, around like eight charity shops, I only got one item, but it's to be expected, you know, you can't have it rosy all the time, and certainly with charity shops, what I'm finding is, you know, it, it's just a, a numbers game, you've got to keep going around them, and soon you'll find something, so, although it says 3.99 there, I paid 99p for this, it's on the back, I think, oh, can't even go... Can't even flip it round. 99p there. Um, but yeah, this goes for £9.96 on Amazon. So that's going up to Amazon, brand new and sealed. And then um, basically, so that was from Stockton Heath. So that was like it. I, I did get a badminton racket, but that was for my dad. It wasn't such a resell or anything. Um, but then from one charity shop, just one charity shop, I got all this. Uh, now I did pay the, uh, sort of a princely sum of 55 quid for this lot. However, this is a brand new and sealed Harry Potter book box set and uh, you know there is some wear so I won't be able to sell it as completely new on Amazon FBA but um, certainly I'll probably do very good or, or like new so yeah um, one that's on brand new and sealed is on for 75 quid so I'll be shooting a little bit less than that but not too much to, to undersell it or anything so yeah there's pretty decent money in that I and mean, we've got all these like nursing books and you know sort of educational books and all that sort of stuff some are like you know 15 20 quid others I think I think these two thicker ones in particular are a little bit more valuable uh, but certainly, you know, a few of, like, these ones here in particular, I think these three here are a little bit more low value. Uh, but I don't think I got anything that I didn't think I could achieve uh, 15 quid on. I did look at rank, however, I didn't look at camel, 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 so maybe one or two of these I might end up not sending in uh, if I look at camel, camel, camel and I see that there's... Uh, an indicator on there that I don't particularly like the look of. So, yeah, I will have to double check, but I feel like on the whole, uh, these are pretty decent picks. And, uh, yeah, I went for anything under, like, 500,000. I think there's one book in there that's 600,000 in books. So, I think that's a fair range. And uh, we'll see. I don't really do books on Amazon FBA, but you know me, I'm always up for a little bit of an experiment. So yeah, uh, send, I'll send these up in my next shipment. Really, really happy because I've not been getting met many Amazon items, as you know. So um, obviously, I'm glad that I've got some here. And uh, I, it means I can send in another shipment pretty soon. So yeah, really happy with that. I'll sign off now, guys, so I'm not rambling too much more. And uh, I will see you in the next one. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did like it as well. Oh, and as well, I just wanted to state, uh, before people start getting mad in the comments, like, oh my god, why didn't you grab that? Uh, the Star Wars Battlefront 2, I think you saw, which was on the Xbox original, and there was a few other Xbox original games there. I did look at the discs, and they were absolutely scratched to hell, so I didn't pick them up. Um, but obviously, I probably would have picked that Battlefront up, and maybe even the Need for Speed 2 if uh, obviously the discs were in better condition for, for selling on Amazon but um, yeah unfortunately the discs were there were some of the worst discs I've ever seen to be honest they were really really bad so yeah um, I didn't end up picking them up if that's why you were wondering you know why didn't I pick them up so yeah um, I will leave it there guys so thanks for watching